But it's a case of looking at every area. And at the top, the directors of the business, which would be yourselves, what is your actual main remit in your business? Now, when you start to put people in place in your business, a lot of the time you're either going to be a visionary in the business or an integrator, but you need to choose. Stephen and I are both visionary in the business, but I thought, well, if we start mixing everything up together, I need it to be quite separate. You're going to push the vision, I'm going to push the integration in the businesses. So it's really clear on roles, on that directorship, because if you all merge, it's like, well, who's doing what? Like, what are we doing? Who's responsible for it? And that's when you start getting finger pointing. Oh, you go, that's not, and especially if you work with your husband or, or your wife, like, oh, can help, like, like, it's like, well, when's that my job? That's supposed to be your job. And it's like, well, no, you was meant to do that. No, I wasn't, you were meant to do that. Anybody experienced that? Yeah. So then it gets really, really clear, like, <laughs> who's doing what? And even if it's not your partner that you work with at the directorship level, that needs to be really, really clear. Because if it's not really, really clear, Sometimes you might go in a 50-50 directorship with somebody, but you might not feel that somebody's doing 50-50 with you. And a lot of time it happens, people get pissed off and they're like, I do everything and I do this and you, get the, you still get the same dividends and you still get the same wage and all the rest of it. And Louise felt it this year. And it's really important that you know, well, what I, is it they're doing? Because if you're able to pinpoint one thing to one person, or one, then it's like, that's your thing. That's when I know you're performing and I know if you're not. Nobody can hide. 